So let's go ahead and complete number 7 of the independent practice from lesson 2.3. Uh, for the first point, I have 3 here. That's my intersecting point. So I have plus 3. And let's see where my next good point is. It seems like it's going to be here, right here. Okay, so for me to travel from the y-intercept to that point, I have to go negative 1. No, negative 2, sorry. Negative 2, 1, 2, and to the left, 1. Okay, and then y is going to be some kind of inequality. Okay, y is going to be some kind of inequality. So it's going to be equal to, and then you can draw a little guy here, and he's going to go up that hill, and all of this right here is going to be shaded, so it's going to be greater than or equal to. So y is greater than or equal to 2x plus 3. Okay, now the next point is going to be right here, negative 2. So we have negative 2. Okay, our point I'm going to use is down here. So to go to that point, I have negative 1. And 1, 2, 3, negative 3, x, y, and you can see that all of this also here is going to be shaded. So that's going to be greater than or equal to. So my other inequality is y is greater than or equal to 1 third x minus 2. And then it was y is greater than or equal to 2x plus 3. Okay. Good job. That's it.